In our last video we saw how to apply windows and door openings to walls. In the 3D view we can see that the windows and doors are actually holes in our walls. If I want to display the window and doors as closed I can apply an image file to them. If I press the space bar and move to the 2D view I can click on a window to select it. Now I can see on the right hand side in the properties menu the different properties of this window. If I look at the texture properties and I look at the file name and click on the three buttons I will open the texture library. If I go to the full texture library by clicking on texture and then go to windows we can see some images that represent windows. Let's choose a modern window. For the time being I cannot see that texture file applied to my window because its transparency is still 100%. Let's set the transparency to 0%. We can now see the texture file applied to the window. But note, it is actually being tiled across that window surface. Let's change the way that that texture file has been applied to the window surface by opening the application properties. And in application mode, Let's click stretch. Now that one image has been stretched across the entire surface. And it actually looks like a window. Let's do the same for the other window. I'm going to click on it, choose another file name. Go to the texture libraries, windows, choose another window. Set its transparency to zero and its application to stretch. Now let's do the same for the door. I click on the door in the 2D window, find an interior door image, transparency to zero, application stretched. You can use these techniques to add any kind of opening including doors, windows or partitions or other decorative effects like wall hung panels or even paintings on your wall. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.